Hey, Potter friends, it's Mia. Welcome to Life with Mia. Today we are unboxing the lettering box from Be Goods Lettering. This is a seasonal subscription box. Um, I believe it's four times per year. It's a combination um, of a lettering box and a wax seal box. And each box is curated so that when you do the things in the box, um, the end result is a completed project. The box also includes a virtual lettering workshop to help you learn and practice and enhance your lettering skills. So one of the things I had wanted to commit to this year was working on my lettering. I have not done a very good job of it. Um, ideally, I would like to practice daily or at least a few times a week, but it's hard to find the time to do that. But I love the lettering box items. Um, Betsy is amazing and um, she sells things outside of the box as well. So um, it's a great resource for wax seal supplies, um, lettering supplies, um, classes and whatnot. So this is the holiday box. I am going to go through what is inside with you. And I love how she has always has the little personal touches on there. So let's see. I like to try to save if I can. All right, so this box. Ooh. Okay, we'll come back to that. I'm going to try to go in order. So here's our card, and that is everything that is in the box there pictured. So the first thing is... There are three acrylic ornaments. And you have this shape. I don't know what this shape is called. A circle and a hexagon. And with that is a spool of this hmm, cream soap color chiffon ribbon so when you complete your ornament um, you can add the ribbon there at the top and hang it on your tree um, or you can hang it anywhere I mean it doesn't have to go on a tree so as an example of one completed um, I don't think I can make this bigger but there in the corner, she's got them like painted and then lettered and then the ribbon is tied to the top. So that's the project for this box. So we've got our acrylic ornaments and chiffon ribbon. Then we have So for early bird subscribers, you also receive this um, dried pressed holiday leaf set. So these are nice to press into the wax. Um, and then your, these are some rounds also to like press into the wax and they make for a really cute decorative piece. And there's different backgrounds, all like holiday theme for your wax seals. And there is a set of three wax seals. So there is a forest green and a cranberry and a pearl. So three wax seals and then two glue sticks. You use the glue sticks to clear the wax from your glue gun to change colors. Sometimes it's also nice to mix colors, but depending on the cover color, it can 
completely override the color you're trying to mix with. His, that was what I found was my experience. So, um, I was trying to mix something that was way too light with something way too dark, and the darker color just overtook the lighter one. Um, but you have, again, forest green, cranberry, and pearl, and then you use the glue sticks to clear the wax. Then our wax seal stamp um, is, let's see, I'm having difficulty getting anything open because my hands are absolutely freezing. Okay, so here's our seal. It's like a wreath. So holiday real wax steel classic black handle. Then we have some cards. Um, all of her cards are custom um, handmade cards. And so we've got two holiday greeting cards. She includes the Euro flap envelopes, which are nice because if you want to letter on the back, you've got a nice deep space here to letter across and center. It looks really nice. So this one says, have yourself a cozy Christmas, blank inside. This one has, says, Merry Christmas, um, blank inside. And then it's got this beautiful red and it's got a little bit of a shimmer to it um, envelope. She gives you some backings for your wax seals. So there's a sheet of those and those are great for, so if you've ever bought wax seals from my shop, they will come with a backing like this so that you can use them as a sticker and stick them where you want to. So that's what it looks like rather than the wax being poured directly onto the item that you're putting the wax seal on, um, it turns them into a sticker. And then we have some glue dots. I've never used the glue dots, um, but if you're having difficulty sticking them onto something, you could use them for that purpose as well. Um, then we have a lettering workbook for the holiday season. And this, um, I already, the, the virtual work, well, I'm late unboxing this. So the virtual workshop already took place and I missed it, but it is um, available to me on Zoom to go back and watch. So you always start with practicing the basic strokes of lettering. And then you have, um, for this book, she included the monoline script. And then there's info on connecting words and then flourishes and then um, some block lettering. And then here are some holiday illustrations. More holiday illustrations. And then you can take your ornament. So there were different shapes, but it was random what shape you would get. So let's say I want to take my circle. And I'm a lettering novice. I can put that on top of here and use it to sort of trace that design on top. Or on this one. And the same purpose. So I love that she and that um, so that you can really come out with something beautiful even if you don't have a lot of skills and then she gives you a handful of sheets of tracing paper so that is the lettering box workbook and then we have a gold pen um, deco color liquid gold opaque paint marker so again going back to her design here um, you can use that on the ornament um, you can use it on those wax seals that you do on top of the paper there's just a lot of fun ways to use and that's one where she used the deco paint 
on top of the wax seal so she went around the circle and then the design of the wreath in the middle is highlighted with the gold paint marker um, and she had indicated on a video that she had like tested it out it doesn't smear so it's really great for that purpose all right and last but not least we have this little pouch which i don't see listed not listed so this is a must have been a gift it's a little taupe colored pouch showing up a little bit different for the color on camera than in person um, it's a little bit of a darker color more of a taupe um, in person it says sunny on the front it feels like a leather or a vegan leather type material and inside we've got some tools. So there is a, um, love this eraser, Tombow um, eraser. I love it so much that, PD says hi. Um, I've got three or four of them around here somewhere that I keep. It's like awesome for when I'm doing my budget and a whole bunch of other things. And then there are two pins. These are Uniball Signo. Um, looks like one is like a forest green, metallic green, it says. And then, um, I think this one is gold, but it doesn't say. And they both say broad on them. There we go. Gold and metallic green. So let's test these out real quick. So that's fun. And I didn't watch any sneak videos or anything, so she may have indicated that she was including an extra gift, but I missed it. Okay, so real quick, show you. I love this color. These would be fun for, uh, <laughs> of all things, thank yous. When I'm writing thank yous on order receipts. These are nice holiday-ish colors. Now, they don't look like they dry quick. Um, but they're really pretty. They're really beautiful. They're definitely not dry. Um, Uniball Signo, metallic green, and gold. Oh, I want more of these. I love the way they write because they're nice, thick. I'm a 0.7 person. 1.0 um, but you don't have to give it a year <laughs> not a year but a good solid minute or more to dry the green looks dry the gold is not but um, once you let it dry you're good very pretty colors so that is the lettering box so we got this little gift I don't know that everybody got this in there um, box. This is probably my fourth or fifth box. Um, so got that. You got your glue dots and your adhesive, your rounds, your two Christmas cards, your pressed flowers, your chiffon ribbon, your lettering box workbook. Your three acrylic ornaments, your wreath, I cannot say the word wreath, wax seal, <laughs> and your wax in pearl, cranberry, and forest green, and your glue sticks. So that is the holiday lettering box. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.